Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. So today's video is going to be um, like a bikini haul slash some of my favourite bikinis that I own, sort of like showing you different styles. Most of them are bikinis, two pieces, um, and I've got one, one piece. I'm not really a swimsuit kind of girl. Um, I do prefer my bikinis, but I just wanted to show you some of the latest bikinis that I just got through the post because they are like my all-time favourite bikini. Like, I finally found the perfect bikini that I've been after. So, I'll start off with my newest bikinis. Okay, so, the first batch of bikinis are from a company called White Fox Boutique. They are Australian. When I first ordered from them last year, I don't remember paying a custom fee. But when I ordered this time, I got two items in each package and I had to pay about £20 customs charge, which was quite annoying because the bikinis aren't cheap from this site, but they are really good quality and they have amazing styles and like a huge colour range. So the first one I got is um, this really nice fuchsia colour, I think it's called fuchsia on the website, um, but it's like a really nice shimmery purpley pink. So I just got bandeau because... I don't really want tan lines and I guess a lot of girls can relate to that so like these come in really handy um, I got this one in a size large and it fits about right uh, you can order sort of like they have different styles of tops in like certain colours and then they have certain style bottoms so for the bottoms it's mix and match by the way so you can pick obviously anything and you can pick different sizes which is obviously a bonus because Especially for curvy girls and plus size women, you're smaller on the top and like you're bigger on the bottom so you want to be able to order different sizes. The only problem I have with this site is that they only go from an extra small to an extra large and I believe an extra large is a UK 14. And that's what I am roughly, like in all clothing sizes but sometimes in swimwear I have to be like a UK 16 or, or an 18 like depending in some shops. Um, so I would say these come up quite small but the size the extra large is like the perfect fit for me however when i ordered a year ago i got um a fong style bottom and this isn't a large and this isn't that flattering on me anymore because i've gained weight <laughs> but i mean i can still wear it but it's just like one of those ones where it's going to cinch you in and it's going to sort of like pinch all your like fat together and just it's not like giving you a flattering shape as such um but like it's something I would still wear, like if I'm just chilling with like my mum and sister on a, like, on one of our holidays that we go on like on the beach or just like in our like private area type thing. Um, so yeah, like I really love the colour of this one and you know, if you follow me on Instagram that like you know I love pink. So moving on to the next one, these are my favourite like style bottoms. The tops, I love them all. Um, but like the bottoms are like finally the perfect bikini bottoms so these are called the belmont bottoms and they have them in black red blue pink yellow um so they're really they're supposed to be like high hipped um and they're like a cheeky bottom and that's like what i was after i was looking for something that would go quite high hipped on me so it gave me like a really nice shape and like the back of these because they're like quite small they go sort of like in your bum cheek so it's not like covering your whole bum so like girls who want to tan as well these are perfect because they're not fully they're cheeky but they're not covering your whole bum so you know if you want to get tan on your bum cheeks you can um i got these in an extra large and they fit perfect like they're perfect i would say for if you're a uk 16 you probably might be able to get away with it it just depends um but like i said i'm a size 14 but these are literally like the perfect fit um okay and as for the top i got this is going to be really hard to show i'm also going to put some pictures on and pictures of like the models on the website it's not a bandeau one well it's bandeau there and then on the back you can it's like all laced and crisscross like this is this is not the best way to show you um like i said i'll include some pictures and i got this in an extra large as well um the quality of this swimwear like is insane like it's worth the price but then you also got to pay for customs and then you got to pay a little bit for postage which isn't too much so it's not too bad but 
you don't really want, some people don't really want to spend loads on a bikini and I can understand that but like now I found the perfect bikini I can justify these prices um I'd say the only bad point about this one is the sides have like um boning in them I think that's what it's called so you know it gives it a bit more structure and when you've got it on they kind of gape a tiny bit at the side but I don't really mind that no one's really going to see that to be honest so yeah they're just so cute I like this one so carrying on with the same one because I when I find something I like I buy in every colour. I'm sure loads of people can relate to that. So what I did is I picked up a red bandeau top. And again, I forgot to say these have bone in the side, so you know, keeps it up and it holds its structure. And um, I got this in a large. And then I got the Belmont bottoms, which are the same as the black, um, in an extra large. So again, these are high hipped and they've got you can see it a bit better actually. A bit of a cheeky bum so I think you could probably say like they're Brazilians or whatever last one from White Fox I picked up a blue bikini and um, these are the Belmont bottoms again in blue these ones are a bit more shimmery nice baby blue one um, size extra large again in the bottoms Um yeah nothing much more to say because like I said I bought them in like every color I did however get a different top hopefully you can see this a bit better so baby blue it's a really sort of like it's really small like I was actually really surprised at how small it is. it's extra large I don't really have big boobs but my boobs were like hanging out of this and like it's getting a bit of under boob as well um, but again it crisscrosses at the back and then obviously it's all laced up and stuff again I'll put pictures up so you can actually see what it's like but got that in an extra large and I'm literally in love with those moving on to one of my other favorite bikinis which is probably a bit more flattering towards um bigger women and curvy women still I mean this would flatter any these would flatter any figure shape and size really um this bikini is from Fashion Nova a lot of you would have seen it on my Instagram it's a really nice coppery um metallic color bandeau top I got it in a size large this is from Fashion Nova if I didn't say um but the bottoms are size large you can't mix and match with this which is a shame but luckily this fits perfectly um these are literally high-waisted bottoms so if you don't really want to have like your tummy out these are really going to cinch you in um it does give you a bit of a wedgie they go up your bum a bit <laughs> um but it's really flattering and like i said like these type of um bikini shapes is that right bikini styles really flat out curvy women and plus size women i can't remember how much that was i don't think it was a lot but fashion nova have some really nice swimwear um it's just a shame you can't mix and match the sizes but yeah they're really nice again if you follow me on instagram you would have seen this one as well this one's from primark here in the uk um obviously they have it in europe and i think they've got it like in new york and boston in america yeah these are huge <laughs> these um are like big granny knicker type style i got these in a size uk 18 because they really they came up quite small i could have got it in a 16 but there wasn't much difference um but yeah i just really like the pattern on it because they're like a really nice shimmery material and the top is like the sports bra type style which i really like so it's just like your usual sports sports bra style and it clicks in the back and um, I got the top in a size 12 because obviously I am smaller on the top and I don't think this bikini was expensive it was probably eight pounds to ten pounds buying both of them and like I said you can buy them separately so that's always a bonus another one that I bought from Primark is this khaki style one big granny mix again size 18 in the bottoms and um, they got a bit of like netting style on that and then the top is a halter neck and it clips around the back and that was in a size 12 um this one's really supportive if you've got quite big boobs um yeah and it gives you more coverage if you don't really want to show like your cleavage and stuff like that so that one's good like i said i've only wore that one once and it's probably under 10 pounds as well um can mix and match the sizes again when i was on instagram i came across these girls wearing like louis vuitton inspired bikinis and i really liked them and i thought i'm not paying like 250 pound for a bikini like that's ridiculous 
<laughs> so I just went on Google and I came across this site called I Offer. It's like a Chinese website and um, I saw they had Louis Vuitton inspired bikinis for like £10 so I thought I'm going to snap that up. Because I saw these girls on Instagram got them from like a boutique place and they were like £45 and I'm not paying that for a bikini either. <laughs> Although the White Fox ones are expensive but I thought I'm not buying from like boutique people on Instagram. I'm not sure whether I could trust them and you know all that. But then again you can't really trust it from this eye offer because it kind of looks dodgy and you don't know if they're going to like steal your money or or what. But like everything turned out fine <laughs> apart from the bikini. So the bi I got it in extra large. I don't know what size that is. They don't have any good sizing guides on their site. Um, so it's a halter neck bikini. As you can see like Louis Vuitton inspired. You can get the white version with the coloured on it but I prefer the brown. Um, yeah just a halter neck one. And then the bottoms um, are like that and they tie at the sides and I find this is like this style can be really flattering on curvy girls when you've just got like the ties at the side because it really like accentuates your figure and shows it off. But oh my gosh these are like a kid size like these may look big but they cover nothing they absolutely cover nothing and if you like pull them right up your button and like they just they just don't flatter you at all. I mean I'm assuming like an extra large is like maybe like a UK 12 or a UK 14 but these are probably like a size UK 6 like there is no way I don't I don't know who would fit in them maybe like a UK 6 or an 8 but they are not made for big women or curvy women or anything so I mean it's not bad because what I plan to do is I'm going to put the bikini top with the black bottoms that I got from um, White Fox um, it looks really nice and you'll see in the pictures um, yeah, like that's like that's kind of what I planned anyway. It's like the bottoms weren't going to fit. So I mean, for ten pound for a bikini, like you can't go wrong. One of my other all-time favourite bikinis, which you've seen on Instagram in a lot of transformation pictures, um, and kind of following the same style as the Louis Vuitton, is this really um, bright coloured leopard print bikini. Um, again, it's a halter neck, and it like clips around the back. Um, and it's got like padding in the cups for a bit of cleavage but this I had this bikini since 2015 and like I said I love it but it's like one of my favorites but I had smaller boobs back then and it fitted better now they kind of just hang out because it's got padding in at the bottom um, um, these are the same style as the Louis Vuitton ones um, I love these like with the lace uh, with the tie up sides because I don't know I feel like they just really flatten my figure they're not they yeah I just feel it really flatters my figure and shows off like my curvy shape um, and then what I kind of do just like when I'm tanning I just kind of put them up my bum a bit just so you don't get like the massive big lines um, and that one was from Asda George which was a few years ago um, and I probably didn't pay a lot for it but um, so yeah obviously you wouldn't be able to get this bikini anymore but I just really wanted to include that like the tie sides bikinis bottoms <laughs> are really nice and flattering on curvy women um, and even plus size women, like I've even seen these on plus size women, they look friggin' phenomenal. <laughs> so as I said, I don't really buy swimsuits just because I don't really wear them. I like to like have a bikini and have like nice detailing on it. But um, I did buy this swimsuit from Topshop for about £18. I think I got a size 14. I'm going to give it Sprout because I've never worn it. Um, but it's just, I bought it because obviously it's pink and you know I love pink. Um, and it's got like a really low back. Um... So obviously if you're not comfortable with having a bikini on or a two piece and like showing your stomach obviously these swimsuits are nice where they'll show a bit of cleavage and they have like an open back or um, anything with sort of detailing on. Like so if you're not that confident um, so you wear swimsuits having something with like a really nice pattern on or detailing will really draw people's attention to that. Yeah so I just want to include like that because it's really nice and it's really good quality and like it's really thick and... So yes, yeah, Sprout's got an extra swimsuit from me. So that's the end of the video. I really hope you guys enjoyed a little bit of like a bikini haul slash my favourite swimwear. Um, and giving you some ideas of different places you can shop at. And sort of giving you a rough idea on sizing and prices and um, stuff like that. The White Fox Boutique I do really recommend. Um, they've got really good quality. They are a bit pricey. Um, bigger women might not be able to fit into them. Um, but definitely check it out, you never know. Um, and again, Fashion Nova is a really good place to buy swimwear. Um, yeah, that's pretty much where all my swimwear is from. But like I said, I found the perfect style bikinis on White Fox. Like, I'm going to be living in those. 
Um, I'm going to leave all the links to all the swimwear down below that I can find and that's in stock and stuff like that. Um, so if you guys did enjoy this video, please don't forget to give it a thumbs up so I know you like them and I can do future ones. Don't forget to subscribe and I'll see you guys in my next video.